Hi everyone and welcome back to Time Lapse Tuesday. Today I'm going to be talking about a little bit of mixed media and the importance of getting to know your materials and tools. I used to buy materials and never use them because I was so worried about wasting my uh, materials and money. So now I uh, happily use them because I get to know what works and what doesn't and um, really important thing is that paints and uh, supports like paper do eventually deteriorate so it's best to use them before that time I used the Strathmore toned tan drawing paper it held watercolor pretty well I used the Prismacolor color race pencil in rose to sketch out um, and I'm actually redrawing one of my Inktober 2016 drawings it's important to play around with your materials because when you first buy them you don't really know exactly how they're gonna work so it's not just swatching them but also just using them and you can figure out if something works for you or if it doesn't and if it does work for you once it runs out you can always choose to either refill the materials or upgrade them and what you don't really like you just give away to someone or never restock them once they're done i decided to go with a mixed media drawing just to explore the tonal values on the drawing and I used a Conte pencil in white to really draw out the highlights of the drawing and then I started adding watercolors to add a bit of color against the tone background. I decided then that I would actually start using the pencil to create textures and I added some Faber-Castell hit marker in cool gray number three to add some strong contrast into the drawing at first. I thought I could layer them but I eventually changed to E.H. Martin Bombay ink in black and white just to uh, speed up the process and fill the gaps. Then I started to work in a galaxy print in the background, which was the main point of this exercise and added some white ink to fill up the larger areas and I just used a cheap IKEA brush to layer, uh, place the ink on the paper. After a while, I looked at it and I needed some more contrast, so I used ink washes from PH Martins and Art Alternatives India Ink, just to be able to get really high contrast from the drawing and build on it with other colors. Another important detail about doing um, these practice pieces is you get to know what materials actually work together in terms of what inks handle um, work well with watercolors and what inks can layer upon each other.
If you enjoyed this video, please click like. And if you want to see more of my art, please subscribe and follow me on social media. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!